great. I mean, it's just it's you know awards are there's there's <laughs> like there are re- literally a million awards in television news, and sometimes it's it's you know you can get sort of caught up in winning awards. This one we put a lot of work into. Um, and we spent a lot of time working on this particular issue with healthcare and healthcare costs, and uh, that was so it's cool. So we did uh, a lot of work on freestanding emergency rooms in the state of Colorado. They're not around the country. Some states have a lot of them. Some states have none. But in Colorado, we have a ton. And people were going to freestanding emergency rooms and leaving with bills of you know two to four to six thousand dollars, and they were going for very sort of minor relatively minor ailments and so we wanted to figure out what was going on and sort of shine a light on industry that didn't have a lot of attention and hopefully in the process educate our viewers as to you know when do you go to one of these places and when should you think about going somewhere else I'm not a financial reporter Uh, I when I was 24 years old I was in a lot of debt and you know I blew through my checking account and didn't even realize it, and so I had a lot to learn about personal financing. But now, um, like to, to be able to win an award in terms of financial reporting, business reporting, I mean, it's cool. It's special. What's what's nice about it to me is that it's a very specialized topic in terms of business reporting. Something I don't necessarily emphasize on, and yet we did something that that worked. Like I said in there, I think the best advice is. Always, always, always consider this the coolest job ever. And the moment that it stops being that, do something else. But for me, like I love this. I get to I get to do a job where I'm interviewing people and making change and bringing light to some areas of the country that need light shown upon them. So, like, have fun. Like, this is a cool job. Don't take it too seriously. <laughs>